tutorial is on stretching your outer hip and thigh with something called the spore stretch, or sometimes it's called supine pigeon. You'll come to lie down on your back with your knees bent. Arms can just rest comfortably out at your sides. And draw your left ankle to your right thigh. Lightly press through the heel to keep the knee in good alignment, but let your toes relax. You might just check in here and see how this feels. This might be as much as you need to start that stretch in that outer hip and thigh. You can also then start to bring your right knee in towards your chest, your hands thread underneath your thigh, flexing lightly through both heels, hugging that knee in just as close as is comfortable. Keep the shoulders down and away from the ears, and the back of the neck long. I'm taking just a few breaths here. There are other options while you're here to deepen your stretch. You can just move your right knee a little bit to the right, and you might find that that gives you a slightly deeper stretch. Not really big. If you'd like to get a little hamstring stretch here as well, and this is what moves us into that supine pigeon, you can straighten the right leg, bringing the heel up toward the sky. to release, you lower the leg down, release your hands, lower the foot to the floor, lower the knee to the floor, pause here, checking in with that right and left side, and then we'll do the other side. Take the right ankle to your left thigh, pause and check in. Another option here is to let your leg move a little bit left and right. Just noticing how that feels and kind of in and out of the posture. And then come back to center, take a full breath in. As you exhale, pull the left knee into the chest, hands come behind the thigh. You can also deepen the stretch by bringing the hands to your shins, it's up to you. And what feels good? Lightly flexing through both heels, shoulders are relaxed here. And with your inhalation, straighten the left leg up toward the sky. You can also play with pointing and flexing while you're here or circling your heel a few times. Keeping that lower back on the floor. Releasing that left heel down toward the buttocks, releasing your hands, lower the foot down to the floor, and release that right foot. Pause again, noticing the right and left sides of the pelvis. 